out of this 11%, 9% out of the 11%, right? So uh, basically, 9 plus 2 is 11. So the 9% is going to apply to every pensioner across board, right? So every pensioner is going to see uh, their pensions increase by at least 9%. Then there is a 2% of the total, which is then going to be spread evenly in terms of a CD value to all pensioners. And that amount was about 15 CDs point 89 pesos. So when you do it that way, then the people who are low earners, right, that extra 15 CDs is actually a higher percentage of their base, right? Than, and, and those people who are high earners, that 15 cities is immaterial. But it's effectively a form of redistribution that we are take, doing. And that the aim of that redistribution is to make sure that the gap between the uh, extreme on this side and the low earners are a bit compressed. And I think he went on to say that about with this indexation, about 80% of our pensioners are going to see their pensions increase by more than the overall indexation average of 11%. In fact, the low earners are going to see their pensions increase by 14.76%, 14 14 almost 15%. So the people at the bottom end will see their pensions increase by almost 15%. And then the people on the far side are probably going to get their pensions increased by approximately 9% the trust will be liquid enough to pay this. In fact, as part of the presentation, the third bullet point that he said also, uh, uh, guides how we arrive at these numbers was that we have to take into account liquidity. Yeah? And then, the, the, then in the same bullet point, he talked about sustainability. So what we do then is that we look at what our forecasted receipts uh, in terms of contributions for the year is going to be. We look at how much pensions we are going to pay depending on the indexation level. Then, as we saw today, uh, we look at what we're going to get from our investee companies as uh, through dividends. And we put all of that together and make sure that whatever number we come up with, uh, it's something that we can pay, at least the cash. Uh, 